Hello everyone and welcome back to testing more things in the laser engraver. We have a Nokia 925 phone that has a cracked screen, kind of works, no updates and stuff like that. We're going to engrave this thing and we're going to put a picture made by Marco Rasina, who is one of my favorite comic book art artists. He makes lots of Overwatch art which is one of the things that we're going to put here. I originally considered this one from Lucio, but then I decided to use the essentially the same picture, but about D.Va, this particular one. Now I removed Reinhardt and Anna from the background so that the picture would fit to the backside of the phone. Then we would put the phone in and try to put focus correctly. Once we had focus, then we'd put the laser to the correct spot that I thought it was in. And it turns out that I overcorrected by one inch to both directions, so we get a test lasing to the wrong spot. After correcting for this, we can then go to the correct spot. And this is why you do the experiments on broken things. Now that the engraving is done, let's see how well we did. Okay, at first glance, the engraving stuff is well done. The problem is that this picture does not lend itself particularly well for engraving. And for those who are interested in how much does the, the phone heat up when you engrave it, I can't really see any heat up at all. Like there's 0.1 degree differences on the phone and even those are not constant and then next we have this Lenovo charger that's completely dead because I thought I don't want to put stickers on my charger I just you know want it to be different from others so that I can tell which one it is so we're going to engrave this diva logo on it this one only has line art so we'll do see how much better line art only pictures work Let's see how this compares to the other one. And what we can immediately see is this is much better. So stick to line art if you want an easy way. Otherwise, you're going to have to optimize a lot. Thanks for watching.